Snakes on the Lane steps up right now here in the final mark of this best of five championship match in the 900 PTZ2 roll off. And he's looking exceptional. Very nice. A 36 for Snakes in the gate of the fifth and final mark here in the championship match. Buck Wild rolling second. Let's see what he can post in his gate here in the fifth and final mark. Thirty-three in the gate for Buck Wild. Thirty-six to thirty-three, heading into the drop of the fifth and final mark. Snake steps up to lane two to start his drop. He rolled a three sixty in the gate. So quick, so efficient he is. Ooh, finishes with a strong 50. A 35 in the drop for Snakes. Buck Wild steps up now for his drop. Rolled a 33 in the gate. Snakes certainly putting the pressure on Buck Wild. Great finish. Great finish, Buck. Buck Wild was a 34 in the drop. Let's check in with Root Down, the scorekeeper. What do these two gentlemen need to scratch out? We got Snakes on the lane needs 190. Buck Wild, Alex, needs 230. 230. Buck Wild, 230 to scratch out. Snakes, 190 to scratch out. However, Snakes on the lane chose to go first. Let's see what he does. 190 to scratch out. He has a slight advantage knowing that Buck Wild needs a 230. So if he can get that get to that 190 quickly, he could put an immense amount of pressure on Buck Wild. There's that 190. He scratched out 40. 80. 120. 160. Beautiful. 160 in the stretch for Snakes. Buck Wild steps up, knowing that Snakes on the lane is in the clubhouse with a 160 in the stretch. He needs a 230 to scratch out. He wants to leave at least four balls. Ooh, that's a big miss. 40 to scratch. Oh, that could prove to be deadly. Needs a 30 to scratch out. Oh, still needs a 30. Finally scratched out. And Buck Wild cannot win, folks. Ladies and gentlemen, hits the hundo anyway. Ladies and gentlemen, your 900 PTZ2 roll-off champion, Snakes in the goddamn motherfucking flippin' lane! Get on up there, pal! Snakes! 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 Real quick, come over here for a second. Snakes on the lane, you were trailing pretty badly in that final championship match. You brought it on strong in that fourth mark. In the fifth mark, however, the final mark, you are on fire. You started with a 36 in the gate. You followed up with a 35 in the drop. Why did you catch fire so late in the match, especially under so much pressure in the fifth and final mark? I just had to find the 40. That's about it. <laughs> Anything else to say. <laughs> Congratulations, dude. You're a very good champion, and you play PTZ like it should be played, my friend. Way to go. Way to go. Snakes on the goddamn lane.